Crypto Games took the world by storm during the last bull run, but not all of those games will survive over the next few years. The Sandbox, on the other hand, is well underway with its second alpha season, and it gives us a glimmer of hope for the future of crypto games. Animoca Brands has been developing the game since 2018 and has achieved a lot since then. Here are three reasons why Exodus is bullish on the Sandbox. If crypto is all about community, then the Sandbox has nailed it with their game maker. It allows players to create their own game experiences through an interface for others to play and enjoy. After you've created your map, you can start placing any asset you want and build your dream world in the metaverse. If you've tried a game engine like Unreal or Unity, the game maker will feel natural to you as you're able to apply logic to most assets in your game. You can add collision between objects so they can't go through each other, program a button to open a door or adjust the health of an enemy on the map. While you may feel like you're simply bag holding a lot of NFTs in this current market, you can at least display them in your game as the game maker is NFT compatible. Because of the options for creativity, think of the Sandbox as a Web3 evolution of Roblox, a comparable Web2 game with 200 million active monthly players and 20 million games created every year using its own game maker. You might be wondering if it's possible to create your own assets to use in the Sandbox, and it is. Vox Edit allows you to create voxel-based 3D models and use them to spice up your game with custom items and avatars. It's also possible to rig and animate the assets to bring them to life. You can even mint the assets you create into NFTs and list them on the Sandbox Marketplace for the Sand Token. Take note, crypto gamers, this is how you stimulate a community. And did we mention that both the Game Maker and Vox Edit are free to use? The Sandbox has received investments from huge players in the gaming world. Square Enix, the legendary video game company behind Final Fantasy, participated in a $2 million venture round. Atari partnered with the Sandbox to bring 3D models of classic Atari game items into the Sandbox metaverse. In return, Atari received several big lands where they will make their most popular gaming creations available to players. Rollercoaster Tycoon in the Sandbox? Seems like it. <laughs> Some other major brands who partnered with the Sandbox to receive land include Adidas, Ubisoft, and the Walking Dead franchise. Top brands putting time into creating virtual land can only mean one thing. They believe the sandbox will be populated enough for the brand exposure to be worth the effort. As one of the pioneers of crypto gaming, the Sandbox offers the whole gaming package, from playing games on unique maps to creating your very own experiences. Both the Game Maker and Vox Edit resemble traditional gaming tools, which might help bridge the gap between crypto and traditional gaming. Many major brands have already shown their approval for the Sandbox, and while crypto games have a long way to go, the Sandbox has made it easier to see the light at the end of the tunnel. Thanks for watching everyone. We've got a lot more videos for you, so click any of these videos so you can keep watching. And don't forget to like if you liked it and sub if you dug it.